everyone. So I've been wa wanting a little pocket cooker for a really long time. I have the little Esbit um, cooker folding stove that takes um, that takes the little Esbit tabs, but I don't really want the Esbit tabs all the time. So I decided to get a little folding stove like this. So far, pretty easy to put together as I'm talking here. That's it. Wow. That was super simple to put together. And then it has the little door over here. Okay, so you saw how easy it was for me to put together. Uh, let's see. It's a little wompy here, so. It's a little, well, it seems a little flimsy, you know, like I can kind of push that in and out. I don't, I don't know if you can see that. Kind of push it in and out. So it's, it's a little flimsy on this side. I'm not exactly sure why either. Maybe I'm not doing something correctly, but it does have the little door where I can put wood in it and all that. So you just fix the problem. You actually need to like pull it tight like that. You need to pull these tight out and that kind of fixes the problem of the flimsiness. Well, a little bit, but anyway, I'm not too concerned with that. Um, okay, let's go ahead and see if we can get fire started. I have my fire kit here ah. and I'm not going to do anything fancy. I'm just gonna take a petroleum jelly, cotton ball, light it and put it in there. Okay. We're gonna see how fast it'll get this boiling. I don't have a, a lid for this yet, so we're just gonna leave it open and see how fast it goes. So let's start the timer, there we go. And with these, you wanna make sure that you are feeding it quite a bit because it is such a small fire, so. Need to baby this it's actually kind of crazy how much you need to how much you need to baby it but it's got a lot of sticks and it just it's hard to keep it going it's been 12 and a half minutes and we have almost a boil I don't know if you can see that but it's almost a boil it's not it's not a rolling boil but it is a boil. We got the boil at about nine minutes. So the main thing about this is that I really like it, but you really have to baby it and you really have to, you know, you have to put a lot of small stuff in it and you just really have to baby it. Even like the really, really small uh, twigs weren't really catching fire very good. So, which is really surprising. It like all turned to ash down here and it just kind of went out so you know um, you just really got to baby it but overall I like it um, as long as I can just keep it babied um, you know this is this is like hot 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 like almost to a rolling rolling boil like so close so this would be sufficient to me um, as in cooking food but maybe boiling water to sanitize it Maybe not so good. I'm gonna to have to pay more attention to it. I did kind of walk away a couple times. Uh, so, you know, it's definitely user error a lot of times. It took me longer to fold it up. I was like, how do I do this? You have to fold in one wall, then you fold in the other. Uh, I'm not gonna to try to take it apart. But the handle here up that attaches here already came off the little rod that was in between holding this together already came apart. So that's kind of a downfall, but I only paid about 
13 14 dollars for this so i'm not gonna cry over it um for best performance this should really be put you know in the wind like directly um in the upwind direction so that it gets constant airflow and the wind and things like that and not like gusty wind but uh just so it gets that constant airflow but what when i got it going it was great um so i'm pretty happy with this um you know, I could also use Esbit tabs in here. I don't see why not. So at least I have that alternative option. And I have a lot of other options that will uh, actually keep a, you know, like, uh, let me see. Like, this will keep a fryer going for about 30 minutes. Sure, it's a very small fire, but it's something. So um, anyway, that's going to be it. And I will see you tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching with my little wooden pocket stove video. Oh, one other thing. My nice thing that I like about this is that it does come in its own bag. So I will put a link uh, to this in the bottom just so you can check it out. There are a ton of other folding stove options out there. So do your research. I did do my research and I just liked this design the best. I don't like the ones that are narrow and tall. I just don't like it. So I like the design on this the best, but that's just me. Um, let me know what you think, and uh, I will see you tomorrow. Bye.